Okay, so day three. Got day three. Day three. Or no, actually day two. I was wrong. Yeah, yeah it's day two. Day two on the trail. Yeah, day two on the trail. Day um day the so oh, I got a schmack all over my We're finally having a mountain house. Yeah, we're there. finally having a mountain house. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, so good. So good. And by the way, I'm uh I can see my face. And it looks like I have pretty chap lips. So I got that going for me. Anywho, um, we are currently near an intersection to Clouds Rest. We got some beautiful sights right now. We can see the backside of the sub dome and half dome. I'll see if you guys can see it. Uh, it's a little bright and sunny. Let's see if I can tap that right there. But uh, that up there is uh, the summit of a half dome. So that was that's it's pretty cool. It's uh, it's a little bit tougher of a day. Um, we came from our last campsite which was uh, around Dilluet Creek um, right after that and had to go around kind of this massive mound of some sorts and we got to see Mount Star King, which is this beautiful dome, and then descended to Nevada Falls and started just to, and that's where we intercepted the John Muir Trail. So now we're officially there. On the John Muir Trail. Yeah, we're on the John Muir Trail. Um, so yeah, we're officially there and uh, we've been hiking along it. Uh, officially, we've done I think about 12 miles uh, total, if not that, just a little bit shy of it. Uh, tomorrow we're going to be heading up to Over the Sunrise, uh, Sunrise Lake, Sunrise Campground to Cathedral Lakes is our goal. Um, and the day after that we're heading to Tuolumne Meadows. Um, and today was an interesting day. On had a little bit <clears throat> A little bit of a, uh, a time getting up. Oh, I'm taking the knife. Knife doesn't need to be clean, does it? You should probably clean it a little. I'll clean it a little bit. Anyways, yeah, a little bit tough time coming up, but we were able to redistribute her weight, redistribute her weight to give her a little bit easier of time because it was what was the climb? It was like a mile and 900 feet, or a mile and a half, 900 feet, with like some really steep parts and then level parts. And so we had to, we distributed the weight and it, it really did help, but we're gonna start bringing her back, uh, bringing her back up to full weight around, uh, looks like 30, maybe 34 pounds. 34 or 35. Yeah, and uh, getting her back up to that. Uh, and let's go check out the rest of the camp. Yep, you will. Oh, you'll, you'll definitely get there. One step at a time. Uh, right now, look over at our tent. We've been drying our clothes because today was our first laundry day. We got to the, our campsite here at about 3 o'clock. So we had a lot of time to just kind of wander around and check out and, I don't know, do chores. That's the last little bit. And then um, over here is Alex and Bill. Bill finally did his journal today. Yes, I did. It's always good to journal. Here's our other campsite. This is the, the Weeks campsite. Roberts. Well, Roberts. Weeks Roberts. Weeks, Roberts. Well, yeah, <laughs> I'll ask us about the story about that later. Anyways, uh, here they are. Alex, wave to the camera. Wave to the people. There you go, Say Bill. Say hello to the people, Bill. <laughs> Say hello to the people, Bill. Exactly. People, Bill. Exactly. So yeah, it's it's been it was um, aside from that last little section, it's been it was a relatively uh, mild day, and honestly, this is kind of just a warm up because tomorrow we're probably aiming for about ten miles, five and then five miles, then ten miles, and then fourteen, and about that point in time we should be doing a normal cadence of about ten to fifteen, and we'll see how we deal with it then. But by that point, we'll be conditioned, we'll be used to. All of this elevation gain. Anyways, sayonara. Hope you enjoyed.